back everyone. The banks of the Canadian River will be busy this weekend as the sand drags return. Officials with the Texas Park and Wildlife Department say game wardens have planned to increase patrols. Fox 14's Jack Kessler details what they'll be looking for. This weekend, tons of off-roaders will descend upon the Canadian River for the annual sand drags. And with all these ATVs, UTVs, dune buggies, pickup trucks, and other vehicles, comes an increase of law enforcement presence to help keep those safe that are coming to the sand drags. Uh, we're going to be looking for safety violations because that is our main priority this weekend. We will be enforcing safety violations, um, sticker requirements to, to operate off-road, and game wardens will also be in force this weekend to make sure families are safe. Texas Game Warden and Public Information Officer Shane Lewis adds that anyone planning on using an off-highway vehicle should follow state laws, including having an off-highway vehicle decal attached to the vehicle. Lewis says if you're going to the sand drags this weekend, to also have proper safety equipment. There are helmet requirements on, on ATVs and, and seatbelt requirements on UTVs, and uh, just uh, get out there and, and wear that proper equipment, put those seat belts on and be safe. Lewis adds regarding age requirements that any ATV UTV operator younger than 14 may not operate unless directly supervised by a legal guardian or other authorized adult. He says when you are off-roading at the Canadian River, it's much like driving a car on a city street. Uh, safety on an off-road vehicle, it's just courteous and common sense. Um, you know, get, give right away to others, um, going through intersections or places that are crowded, do it at a very safe and reasonable speed. At the Canadian River, Jack Kessler, Fox 14 News. Lewis says since there is a burn ban in effect, if you're going to be grilling or have any fires for cooking, make sure the flames are enclosed and extinguished before you leave.